The next poem is called Out West. I went for several years to the uh, Concho River Literary Festival in San Angelo, and I, or San Angelo as they pronounce it. Um, that, and uh, uh, I liked being in that different part of the world, that kind of openness, and that's one of the themes in the poem. There's a loneliness in that big light, not on the Pacific, where the water knocks it away, but you feel it in Fresno, San Angelo, Rock Springs, Grand Island. It's worst on Sundays, unless church knocks it away. It's worst in the 20s downtowns, but even in the picket-fenced yard, it's always there. It broods over the Siouxlands, the Crow, the Missile Ranges, it will hit you in the parking lot of a Walmart. Maybe the Indians have come to terms with it. There are things they won't say. In Litchfield, Naperville, Savannah, you don't have to think of how your people, how people haven't always been there. People don't belong there. You might think so. You can think, of course, having been to the pretty colleges with their quadrangles and domes and grottos, their arcades and walled gardens, statuary, steeples, plaques. But you don't have to back there. Out here, you have to. Try going downtown some Sunday afternoon in a place like San Angelo, among the jewelry stores and loan companies, the dusty plate glass storefronts. There might be music from a bar, a woman laughing, two boys, best friends, might be skateboarding, under Art Deco or terracotta ornaments among the abandoned commercial professional hives. But over them all, the light tilts, swoops, sweeps the streets, scrapes the mesas. The river, if it knows something, won't say. But people may be clutter, an irritant, an outbreak, something that simply scabs over eventually and falls or heals away. Or maybe, for some reason of our own, we've gymnastically contorted ourselves into inventing hopelessness. Brought here, or having stumbled in, we listen to a song on the oldest radio and consider the evanescence of galaxies in a pan flash of galaxy light. Maybe it's even that we're meant to feel this, to come out here, unravel, yield everything we've hoarded in one responsive throb, then go back to walking around, smiling, driving everybody out to the sleek New Mexican place by the flashy motels. Big table, we're all talking, laughing. Girls fill and refill the tea glasses. Boys bring salsa and chips. You ask the mariachis to play one from Guadalajara. And when we all come out, it's dark. The night's better as the depth of the Rockies is better. All those stars. The people won't always run the night, either, on the wind-ravaged, sun-savaged planet. The Rockies themselves are eroding as we push through their night in our clever machines, heating it up a little with dinosaur fumes, scoring it ever so slightly as we pass from street to scratchy street, streaking it with fugitive light.